Hi, I'm Richard, and over the last 10 years, I've helped students get into LSEs, BSc management with a 91% success rate. That's a whopping 13 times the average acceptance rate of just 7%, which means for every student applying, there are 12 more clever clogs trying to take your place. Today, for the first time, we are going to look at a number of tips to give you the competitive edge in your applications. Now, whilst the entry requirements are AAA, maths is required for this quantitatively rigorous course. So my number one tip for any LSE course is to show a long-standing track record of maths and an interest in learning more. I strongly recommend pushing for that A star in maths. And if your school offers it, considering further mathematics and pushing for an A star in it as well. If your school doesn't offer further maths, I encourage you to talk to your referee and let them tell the university that further maths was not an option for you. You can go beyond this as well. There is the TMUA, that's the Mathematics for University Aptitude Test, which will give you an advantage over competitors, as well as external courses that you can take on something like Coursera. Just doing one or two weeks of university level math and seeing how different it is from the A-level or IB syllabus and talking about this in your application will give you a dominating advantage over the competition. So talk about maths often and talk about maths regularly. My second tip is to talk to your referee. Whilst you write one 4,000 character statement, there is another statement which is often overlooked. That is the statement of your referee. They will also write about you and LSE looks at that reference before they look at your application. So find out who's going to be writing your reference, usually it's someone at your school, talk to them, talk to them about your interest in mathematics, talk to them about your interest in other areas of management. If they don't know you very well, you're at a disadvantage. Find them, interview them, tell them your best traits, and ask them to include these strengths in your application so that you have two statements helping you to get in. Now we're gonna look at the five pillars of any personal statement to help you to stand out from the crowd. Number one for management is a mission statement. That is, what is a problem in the world or a challenge that management can help solve? A lot of people talk about ECG and sustainability, or the rise of AI and the challenges that proposes, or perhaps even something as new work from home policies in a post-COVID era. There are so many interesting challenges, and I recommend you to go bold with one that you want to apply to management. Now the second pillar, and very importantly for a BSc management course like LSEs, is simple, but you'll be amazed at how many people overlook this. Do not forget to explain what management is as an academic subject. Many students are going to be talking about how they've managed a colleague at the local bar or wherever they've done some work experience. As an academic discipline, management is 14 different subjects. Accounting, marketing, and finance are often talked about. To really stand out, I suggest you look into organizational behavior, organizational theory and structure, procurement. If you don't know what procurement means, and someone else does and talks about that for a whole paragraph of their statement, they're gonna have an advantage over you because the admissions officer says, this is someone who knows what they're getting in for. And it's really important that you understand management as an academic discipline. Now, number three, work experience. It is essential you get some sort of work experience in there. Even if it's just a day, half a day, shadowing someone, talking about organizations and what you learned on that day and the key skills that you've been a part of will help you to stand out. Number four is university understanding. So you have to write the same personal statement for all of your five UCAS choices, which can make it difficult, particularly for applying to other common courses such as Oxford's economics and management or some of the other slashes. Now, LSE's pure management course is the number one straight management course in the UK. But it's important to maybe, if it is your first choice, give a few tips here. So a sneaky trick is to mention a public lecture you've been to at LSE. Mention a particular LSE professor you like. 
Now, this will look impressive to any university application, but it's also a hint to the admissions department that LSE is your first choice. For example, I greatly enjoyed going to Professor Malhotra's public lecture on the rise and dangers of AI and how management can solve it at LSE last November. I would love to discuss such theories in office hours with her. This gives you an advantage and makes you look like a serious candidate. And number five, one of the most important of all, a solid career plan. What are you going to do with management? How are you going to solve that mission statement that we talked about? Immediately after graduation, what's a specific job title at a specific company in a specific location in the world that you're going to apply to? And how will that progress? What sort of team do you one day end up wanting to be managed? So if we go through those tips and the five pillars, you will give yourself a huge advantage over the competition. Now, that's just a handful of the 28 tips that we have developed through years of being professional admissions consultants. If you'd like to work with me or one of my amazing team and colleagues, please do contact us using the information on the screen now or in the description below. But we've got more than that. You can also sign up for a perfect exemplar personal statement to show you the level of a top university LSE application in the description below. And if you'd like to like, subscribe, leave a comment, we'll try and get back to you with all the questions that you have. Good luck in your applications. I wish you all the best.